here is one of the reasons why we are fishing this mark for sea trout. As I said before, a freshwater entrance could be pinnacle for sea trout fishing. Having that fresh water, especially at that depth there, as you can see, is vital for good sea trout fishing. I think personally anyway. Anywhere I go that's got a fresh water entrance usually provides some good sea trout fishing. Usually. But that's me finished setting up my fly rod here. Normally I do an introduction, however, Logan's been down the shoreline for what, 10 minutes? And he's already hit into two sea trout already. So he's making me look bad here. <laughs> so again, both of us are using this yellow dancer fly here. A notorious rainbow trout fly. Uh, but again, works perfectly in the sea for sea trout, as you'll see during this video. There's the seal, Michael. I'm in, Michael. <sighs> Michael. That was so unexpected. <laughs> I'm looking at my net. There we go, guys. First fish of the day. It really was not expected at all. Oh, there we see through Man again, Michael. Oh. oh, that's a good one. Oh. Oh. Michael. This is a better one. Mate. <laughs> That was a good take. Michael. Oh, good one. Oh, it's off. Oh, mate. Michael. That was a big one. Big. <sighs> yeah, mate, a good size bigger than that one I caught earlier. I've never seen it, mate, but mate, <laughs> it just, mate, it just started shaking its head instantly. Like, oh, Michael! I just got another follow. Yep, it just came to the surface there. Nah, luck would have been if I landed that one. Ah, 
<sighs> well guys, after about an hour of abstinence of not catching anything, Logan just lost a very nice size sea trout. Uh, obviously he's a bit of a distance away, so I'm taking his word for it. And he says that was a nice size sea trout, so fingers crossed guys, we can get back and try and hit it again. But time will tell. Unlucky Logan. Really? <laughs> the joys of sea trout fishing, isn't it? Uh, luckily, the wind has calmed down a lot since this morning, which is good. We're kind of getting into the windbreaker, so that makes casting a fly a little bit easier for us, a little bit more productive for fly fishing. I'm still yet to try and catch my first sea trout this season, but again, just need to persevere. Tide should be probably another hour till it's at its peak high tide, so we've still got a bit of time to be fishing. Normally if I'm fishing for sea trout, I'll change up any method of stripping line basically. You can do fast stripping, you know, something like this, which is, that's what I tend to lean forward to, to be honest, because I want to try and imitate a, a bait fish. So I want it to be erratic and dancing in the water as much as possible. You can do figures, figures of eights and stuff like that. Uh, keep this fly going in steady at a slow pace. But again, I just I'm quite a, a fast stripper to say. <laughs> I've always had a lot of success just fast stripping. As I said, it just keeps that fly dancing, and that's what we want because that theoretically is what's going to entice a sea trout to hit. Uh, Logan, on the other hand, is doing extremely well. He's had two sea trout to the net and he missed a very nice size one. They did have it on, but... Been a good day so far though. Uh, i seen some action. i seen a, a sea trout jump just over to my left there, actually. So, there definitely is sea trout here and they're plentiful, so... Uh, basically, I was fishing around far on the left hand side there this morning with Logan. Uh, unfortunately, Logan had to leave because of an emergency, so hopefully things are alright with him. But I am still on a quest to try and catch my first sea trout of the season. As you can probably tell, it is high tide now. So, wading is a little bit difficult. It is quite, there's quite a depth of water here, and as you can probably see behind me, there's quite a lot of obstructions behind for casting, but. I'll just have to try and give it my best shot and see what we can accomplish here. Even if I have to pivot myself, it's just the casting is a little bit difficult. As you can tell, this is bloody deep. But I want to try and catch a sea trout for the first of the season, so I just need to try my best. But on another note, uh, that yellow dancer fly that Logan was using that got the two sea trout this morning has been absolutely deadly. He's had countless of hits on it as well, which is good. So, I've stuck with the fly because I do think it's a, a really, really good fly for using for sea trout. Well, I've chosen this area mostly because of the windbreaker that's here, uh, but also there's actually a fresh water outlet here to my left hand side. And again, this is just personal opinion, guys. I honestly think that the sea trout fishing is a lot better when you've got some sort of fresh water source at your disposal. Luckily for me, the weather has kind of brightened up a bit compared to this morning. This morning was a little bit dull. I don't actually mind it dull, to be honest. Usually I feel the sea trout come to the surface a little bit better. Uh, but it was quite cold. It is still pretty cold right enough, but I'm hoping towards the latter part of the day, fingers crossed, I can actually get my first sea trout of the season on the fly. Just 
just got a rise over there. As I said, I'm I'm restricted with the casting at the back here because of the tide, but I can only I can only try. Oh, yep, that's us in. Lovely, lovely. That's us in. Oh, ho, ho. lovely. Nothing, not particularly of great size, but it's certainly a sea trout. It's fighting like one, regardless of the size of it. Oh, ho, ho. lovely, awesome, absolutely awesome. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. I'm so happy, guys. Honestly, I'm so happy. First sea trout of the season, and it looks like it's a bar of silver as well. Yeah, that is awesome. Oh, look at that, guys. <laughs> That is absolutely awesome. <laughs> Get my net quickly. Oh, absolutely lovely. Oh, there we go, guys. First sea trout of the season on the fly. Absolutely over the moon. Over the moon. <laughs> oh, man. Telling you guys, that yellow dancer, absolutely brilliant. Wow, look at that. We'll quickly get this released. Oh, lovely. Bar of silver, guys. Can't beat it, honestly. There you go, buddy. Oh, absolutely chuffed. So chuffed, guys. Brilliant. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. Oh, yes. Well, that's the end of the session. And uh, I must admit, it was actually quite a good session for the first week of the new season. Uh, Logan managed to get two seats out in the morning. He got a few hits as well. I got nothing. But Logan left, and obviously I had to come round to a new mark because I was adamant that I needed to catch a sea trout. So I'm pretty happy to say that I did. And what a fight it put up. It might have only been very small, but <laughs> the fight they put up, especially on the fly rod, absolutely immense. So pretty happy at that today, guys. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.